Nihao Ma Peng Yu. That's the Mandarin Chase. That's three mile, two furlong, zero to one thirty. Up the top is Dave Brailsford for Paul Road. Six to one joint favourite with Tribe of Steel, Seals, Intraction, Moonlit, Amoya Super, Bishop Brennan, Tiger Cut. The other joint favourite, Fenestra for Tam King. Another World Sphinx Waltzing, Bootsy, Spanish Steps, Kubla Khan, Wild Prince, Admiral Bing, Mighty Dev, uh, Dell's Half, DeAngelis, Lady Sphinx and Outlaw Torn for Obi-Wan. Field of 20. And off they go. So no pace in this, unlike the first race. And they come to the first as a ditch and one of 20. And have we lost one there? Outlaw Torn is out of the race already. Bad luck. Serious duel. Yeah, it sucks when they fall early. And over the second they go. And Carl Aragonte has the two horses up front. No pace. No one's taking them on. They come to the third. Ooh, the second one there reached for it. Another world. Lucky for the jockey to be still in the saddle. Carl's got a fairly strong stable this year, so these leaders might be a bit hard to run down. What sort of weights they're carrying, especially in other worlds, probably well weighted in this race. So it's moonlit from another world. Dell's half is in third with Fenestra, who's one of the joint favourites, with Dale's Braceford, so the favourites are right up there at the moment in the firing line. Out wider there, Wild Prince. Um, some of these horses are just not trying to cross at all around this bend, which, yeah, I just find that frustrating. It's, it's strange how on some tracks you come to bends and horses make their way to towards a rail, if they can, and then in some tracks they just run wide the whole way. It's just it's one of those things. Hopefully the race gets a bit better next for SO7. So um, it's the two stable mates together as they go over that one. Moonlit in another world. And then we've got Fenestra, Moya Super, Dave's Brow for Del Half. All up there. Wild Prince, Tiger Cut, Bootsy as they go over the ditch. They're all over that nicely. Lady Sphinx is also there. Um, around midfield with Mighty Dev in traction, Sphinx Waltzing, Bishop Brennan, DeAngelis down on the fence there for F1 Follis in the blue. Worse than midfield. And out the back there we've got Admiral Bing, Kubla Khan, Tribe of Seals and Spanish Steps who will no doubt make its way through the field later in the race. So they go, oh and once dropped the jockey there, Tribes, Tribe of Seals is out. So that's disappointing. They run down the stretch here. They come to the water. Past the winning post. Probably a lap to go on this track. Now they're crossing. Some of them are anyway that can. Down this left hand up. I'll straighten up and come to the 11th. And it's moonlit in another world together. So they come to the 11th and up and over they go. Oh, no, they're all still standing. I thought one might have just uh, reached for it. We've got one pulling up here. Spanish Steps, so bad luck, Martin. It's disappointing when they pull up. So they go over the... Oh, mine's getting pulled up as well. Wild... Prince. So two of the three commentators are out of the race, so now it's just up to Stu to join us with Admiral Bing as they go over the 13th. And it's another world and moonlit together. And they're about three in front of Dave Brailsford and Dell's half, Fenestra. Tiger Cut the Angelus has moved up nicely along the fence. Out wider Tiger Cut, Mighty Dev. A little closer now. 
Bishop Brennan, Lady Sphinx in traction, Bootsy, Admiral Bing, and Moya Super, Sphinx waltzing, and Kubla Khan. They've cleared the 15th. A mile left to run. These two leaders are looking good at the moment. Still a way to go. Moving out of the pack now is Mighty Dev. In fourth is Dell's half, Fenestra. Tiger Cut. Dave Brailsford, jockey with a stranglehold there on the horse. Gave it a bit of rain, then ran out of room. So circling the field is the joint favourite, Fenestra, and that's moved up and moved up strongly and jumps fast. And has opened up a five, six length gap on the field already as they come on down to the home turn. And it's rolling around here and straightens up world clear of moonlit dave brailsford comes out of the pack as well another world kicking up again along the fence with tiger cut dell's half mighty dev bishop brenham over the 17th and uh, finestra starting to run out of legs here by the looks of it and dell's half looms up and takes the lead from dave brailsford they come to the 18th and dell's half jumped at whirl and is about two clear of another world. Tiger cut. Fenestra. Dave's Brailsford. I reckon the joint favourites are gone. So they run on down to the second last. And Dell's half jumped it nicely. And leads clearly from another world. Tiger cut. But this race is over. It's just got to jump this one. And it does it nicely. Race is over. They come on down to the furlong. And Dell's half's a mile to you. And uh, runs onto the course proper here. And Dell's half is going to be one of the more comfortable wins you will see in the league. And gets up another world second. Fenestra held on for third. Tiger cut fourth. So I think that's two in a row for Dell. What a way to start. I think it's week seven and Dell's half. Hollywood Hinton, congratulations. First. Another world, Carl Aragonte was second, nine lengths away. Third was Fenestra Tam King. Fourth was Tiger Cut for Pontypool Racing. And fifth was Bishop Brennan for Kevin Menahan.